For ACUSports.com, I'm Grant Boone. We're here with football coach Ken Collins out on the Wally Bullington practice facility. Uh, a little nip in the air for spring practice. You got the uh, the heavy duds on. Yeah, well, I'm not very tough, so I've got to <laughs> I've got to get the long sleeve and the pants out. But uh, yeah. but it's good. It's really good. Practices like this, you can you can tend to practice a little bit longer, and nobody really look ever looks at the at the the period clock over there, and, and it's not that big a deal because nobody's really exhausted. But uh, so it's it's good. It, it was good weather today. Uh, a f just a few practices this is the end of your first week of practices uh and, and you, you know you you kind of gave me the the gentle ribbing for asking you the other day uh, about who stood out it's too early to even know that but but what just generally what have you seen from your team well uh our guys are line, we're, we're so much further ahead of this time uh when compared to last year defensively our guys are communicating last year i was fussing at them constantly hey at the safeties and the corners and outside backers, can we communicate? Well, now it's just like it's it's easy. So that's what you want. You want guys to step in and hey, we just practiced maybe a month or two ago, and uh -huh. that that's what you want them to feel like. And that's what's happening on defense. Offensively, our offensive line looks really good. Really? Uh, our tempo is really good, and uh, you know we're throwing and catching, and we don't have much in yet. Uh, for some of these guys, we've got way too much in already. You know, so uh, but it, but it's good, and our guys are responding really well. Let's go back to what you said earlier about defense. Is that just because Coach Doolin and Coach Roboto have, have had a year here, because you've had a year here, or is it the players themselves responding? Well, probably a little bit of everything. And uh, the bottom line is when you're a new coach coming in, you have got to change the culture of whatever your department you're, uh, you're, you're in charge of. You have to change that culture to what you want. Mm. And these guys know what to expect that now. They know, you know what, if they walk for a single step on that practice field as a defensive player, then they're going to get ran. If uh, if they don't jog to every single drill, if they're not there right now when Coach Doolin blows his whistle, if they're not, if they can't teleport themselves immediately right in front of him, then they're in trouble. And they know that now. So so that's just some of the basic stuff that we're not even having to mess with, really. And, uh, you know, guys, are, guys will let you get away with – guys will get away with what you let them. And, and if guys don't uh, run to the next drill, you got to pop them anyway. And, and uh, we're all human. So that happened a couple times a day. So you fuss at them, fix it, and then move on. You're making me nervous. Is Doolin watching me right now? Uh, I, I don't know. Do you feel him staring I, I, at you? I can feel right at the back of my head here. <laughs> hey, uh, just last thing here, a couple of guys, we can talk about this as, as we get deeper into it, but just a couple of guys have switched sides of the ball. We saw Travis Tarver last year as a running back, now on the defensive side of the ball, and we saw a linebacker, Cy Wilson, moving over to the offense. Tell us uh, quickly about those two. Well, with Travis Tarver, he is a guy, he's a, just a good athlete, yeah. good football player. Uh, I would like to have him at running back right now. Mm -hmm. We're a little bit thin at running back because of Harkless not being here. Right. <clears throat> but ultimately, he is going to be a top-notch linebacker. He can, and he played that at McKinney. He, yes, he did. And so it's not new to him. Um, he can get from point A to point B the way you want him to. He's got when, – when somebody flips a ball out there in the flat – He's there and he's in position, and he just got to, you know, he's got to polish up on his tackling and yeah. all that. And uh, Cy Wilson, we have a need uh, at run at uh, fullback right now, and he looks the part. He looks like an old school fullback. Hey, let's get it on, and uh, he's just going to have to polish up because he's never done that mm -hmm. before. So he's a guy who's who's really taking baby steps, uh, but he's caught balls that we've uh, thrown to him, and and uh, he's got no problem uh, running into people. So that's that's good at fullback. And you have the luxury here in the spring to see how they adjust, right? Oh yeah, we don't play on Saturday every, so it's a it's a deal where you come out here, you just get better and and, yeah. and improve. And, and our main thing is is to figure out what kind of tools are we working with here, because we want we don't want to use a a uh, Phillips screwdriver that where a, where a where a flathead should be should be used. It's a way easier when you use the right tool. Figure out what these guys can do. Figure out where their groove is and try to keep them in that groove. All right, one week of spring football in the books. For Coach Ken Collins, I'm Grant Boone for ACUSports.com.